<laughs> no. Hello, welcome to I See the Light. I am Queen G. I am the light. And here we are on a Tuesday morning. It's about 9 a.m. I'm going to do a little reading, a little um, positive thoughts and all that good stuff. So I hope this is reaching y'all in good spirits and high vibrations. And you're not letting nobody dim your light. I hope you guys had a great weekend. I had a pleasant one. Um, I'm relaxed and I'm ready to get it in. Okay, I already did the downloads. Um, I pulled the energy. I don't know what they are. Um, they usually fall out where I can't even see them. Seems like I don't do it on purpose. It just happens that way. So I'm just as surprised as as surprise, as surprise, surprise, surprised as you. That's weird. Anyway. Today we're drinking um, a detox. My detox consists of tongue tied, um, turmeric tea, green tea, turmeric, um, red pepper, cinnamon, honey, lemon, and um, apple cider vinegar. Ooh, ha ha, that's spicy. Woo, if that get in there. That's going to get in there and do something. I think that's going to help with mucus and things like that, that build up to make us sick. But that right there, I, mean, I might need to, I might need to put a little, excuse me. I'm, I'll be back. I'm going to leave it running. I really am. Yeah, this, it got kind of cold too. So I'm going to add a little water and warm it back up. Cause it's spicy. Hold on. I think I had too much turmeric in it, so I poured some of it out, put some water in it, some more honey. I'm going to put a little more lemon juice in there, and I should be good to go, because I'm still feeling the burn from it. And um, I know that I barely put any um, uh, red pepper in there, because... I was like, wow, I never put this, this is the less amount I ever put in here. So that turmeric must have a spicy kick to it. Ooh, I feel it in my chest, baby. Oh, I can't, I can't drink a whole cup of that. I, I, uh, uh. <laughs> well, anyway, that's warming up. Waiting on it to warm up before I get started. So I hope you had a good weekend. I didn't do much of anything. It was just pleasant. That's all. I'm just that person. I be chilling. I don't know. It's just. Hold on. I think it's gonna ding in a minute. Let me go back.
Hey guys, I'm, I'm hearing this song. Mr. Telephone Man, there's something wrong with my line. When I dial my baby's number, I get a click every time. Mr. Telephone Man, something's wrong with my line. Trying to dial my baby's number, I get a click every time. Somebody is sad. Why come it's always that? My energy. <laughs> Maybe it's me. I don't know. Sure. All right. So I got it hooked up now. Let's see. Let's see what it tastes like now. I bet you it's still spicy. I poured half of it out and added water. Let's see. That's so much better. Yeah, I don't feel that kick right now. And it's hot. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, let's get it in. First, I'm going to start with a prayer. Let's see, I have one over here somewhere. Well, it do still have a kick to it, but it's not like it was before. Because I thought I'd put a prayer out. Here it is over here, all over there. Okay. Dear Heavenly Father, give us, as we pray, the knowledge that you will breathe life again into the dry bones of all we have hold dear. Give us, we pray, those great three gifts, faith, hope, and love, that we may see this time of trial through. In the mercy hour of our prayers. I don't know what that means. I, did I wrote it down or what did it say? In the, in the mercy, hear our prayers. In, our, in your mercy, hear our prayers. In the mercy hour, hear our prayers. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Breathe on me, Lord. Breathe on me, Lord. Breathe on me. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, breathe on me. Okay? Yes, 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 breathe on me. And then I also saw this that I thought was kind of cool. Just, just, just a little bit of motivation. Smile power. You know? Smile at someone. It tells them that they are valued. A, a greet and, and greet with a smile helps a person relax. It also makes you... Um, look more attractive when you smile that's a little too hard you see hey what kind of smile uh the pictures of my uh oh my uh mama used to get so mad at me got so many um elementary pictures where i just would not smile i'll be like <laughs> Gap, and I did not like to smile. I ended with the gap. There's two kids. My older brother that's passed watches over me. R.I.P. Big brother Jeff, Jeffrey B. Jeffrey, Jeffrey, a hard hitter. I feel sorry for people, but when people uh, mess with me, because Jeffrey's gonna go do some things to him. Jeffrey is a um, a beast. We have beasts in our family. Anyway, um, he had the pretty white, straight, white, beautiful, strong, white-ass teeth. Uh, straight, just beautiful, like they just, you know, was just some dentures created from um, the most high or something. They just was some great teeth. And then me, I come along with this because my dad's got a gap, so I come along with this. Why the girl got to have a gap, you know? So all my elementary pictures and shit even i mean most of my pictures well i did smile on a few um were like but you know I, i've come to grow into it now 51 years later let's get it in uh the first card up is nothing so this is going to be the truth 
somebody's in the background gossiping. There's some people gossiping about somebody. Isn't it always somebody talking about somebody? I caught myself talking about somebody yesterday. I didn't even have no business doing it. I'm not lying. I, I did. I was I was being messy yesterday. I was all up in somebody's dang on family problems. Uh had no business being there. God forgive me. Um well, nobody's perfect, but at the same time, that's not an excuse. That's that's one of my downloads. But the deal is, yeah, there's somebody in the background gossiping. You never know who's gossip about you and your family. It'll be like somebody you least suspect. It'll be somebody like you just might have had work with in the past for a couple of months, and you, you chopped it up with them about a few things. It ain't over there talking about it to somebody. You ain't seen them in months. You know what I mean? Uh, and it comes crumbling down. Mm, boom. What goes around comes back around. God got you. Don't worry, big baby. Um, that's probably what it is. That's got that the person that people are gossiping about the downfall of somebody that when they thought they was up and then they were down. Boom. It all came crumbling down. Please, Lord, let's rebuke this. Lord, look. We talking about some low vibration. Mm 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 mm. Oh, well, let's just. I'm pleased. I have enough problems of my own, you know. Let's be talking about my problems, cause I got some. I damn sure do. But what I do know is I'm gonna get through them like I got through all the rest of them, cause God saw me through them all. I'm trying to learn how not to worry so much about those things and just let let it come as it goes or figure it out or, hey if you can't solve it today it's always tomorrow if it's given to you right let's see but there's some low vibration and I know that ain't my energy because I'm trying my best to stay afloat I'm trying my best to stay I'm trying to stay positive so that I can have a positive outcome in life it's just change man Listen to the messenger. I'm the messenger. I'm telling you. Listen to the messenger. Now, everybody is not, uh, gives you good messages, all right? Some people, some people, some people will tell you, give you bad advice because they just don't want to see you um, make it. Where that little thing go? Somebody here crazy. They don't want to see you prosper. They want to see you fall so they can j joke and laugh behind behind the scenes on your ass. Let's see. Look, somebody's saying, God, please help us, or please help me, or please help us. I'm going to ask God to help us. Help us all, God, because it's a trying time. Like, we in some times where we don't know who the hell to trust. Is there anybody out there we could trust? Drink more water. I will. Sex fantasy. Somebody. Somebody dick and dirty. Somebody. Somebody's fantasizing about you in a sexual way. Superpower power up. My superpower is God. Like, just knowing that, um. If God got me, I ain't got nothing to worry about. That's my superpower, baby. And then, on top of that, the powers that God give you. Ooh, they're so super. So super duper. We did some return to sender. We we, we got to do that because they, boy, they was trying to slide us. They was trying to, ooh-wee. They were trying to get us. Look, look. But I'm smiling smiling that's my superpower my superpower is happiness and joy and god mm -hmm. see you stay on somebody's mind and guess what because of that they have a restless mind do you see how that works out how that comes out and together because spirit wants you to understand that this is the truth this is the truth remember the first blank card was a blank card which means the truth to me Pray for us to come back together. Somebody wants you back. Remember I just, what did I just say? Mr. Telephone Man. There's somebody's side. 
It's like a hunting energy. This will not go fucking away, will it? <laughs> You're different. That's what they say. They've always told me that. They always told me that. They used to say, she's different. Or they would just treat me different. Like, I'd be the one just standing there with the click. In a click. Didn't want to really even be there. Wasn't even pretty much noticed. You know? Yeah. I was different. Watching you from afar. Longing to be with you. That's where they are. They're watching you somewhere. They're somewhere, some kind of way watching you. Just want to know. But look, somebody's saying next. Ah, she said like that. That's pretty harsh. That's like, you know what? Uh-uh. Nah, it's enough for me. No. Next. Okay. Riches of spirit, not of the world. Yes. Some people just be like that. That's them chosen people. <laughs> well, we we have our downfalls now. Hey, didn't didn't Jesus go and pick some of the the shysties brothers the for his disciples? He wanted them soldiers. He wanted the, he didn't want the little ninny pickers over there that ain't never only thing they've ever had or experienced is in pain is maybe stumping their toe or having a paper cut. No, oh, he wanted warriors like. People have been stabbed and shot at it. Shit. Been to the pen and out. That kind of shit. Excuse me, but it's true. Wow, whoa, dang. Ooh, wow, whoa, dang. So it's kind of like um, Jesus had a posse, you know? Like a gang. It was a gang. His gang, you know, he, he was the leader of the gang. But his gang was spiritual. <laughs> That's all. Look, they're, they, they're, they're so amazed with you or whatever I'm thinking. Look, they spying on you talking about, dang, wow, whoa, dang. They're just missing out. They feel like they're missing out on some good shit. <clears throat> they know they messed up. Look, escape. Um, You might have to escape from this person. Like, oh, you did an escape. That's what I'm hearing. Um, you, you, you escaped from this person and now they're spying on you. This is the truth. Look at your shine, baby. You shine bright like a diamond. You, they can't help but find you because you're shining so bright, big baby. Um, soulmate love here. Twin flame 222. Two, two. The appearance of someone in your life who will be able to assist um, your growth. Assist with your growth, okay? It's two people becoming one, twin flame. Usually twin flames don't get together. So this may be more of a soulmate if it's, if it's so. Then if, when, when twin flames get together, wow, angels sing in heaven. Don't let nobody dim your light. Don't let nobody dim your light. Don't let nobody dim your light. Period. Period. Look, lighthouse, see there? You got that power. That's that superpower, that light, that shine. And that's why this person's saying, whoa, dang, wow, man, they spying on you and shit. They... Look. They opened the Pandora box on your ass. That's what they did. They should have never opened that joker up. See, they fucked up when they fucked, fucked up and made the wrong turn. Now they miss you. This is a hunting energy. I be feeling it. I'm like, would you please leave, leave me alone, hunting spirit? You're a personal legend. Um... You're removing all negative energy, period. You're removing it all. You're a trendsetter. Didn't want to be like you. Uh, somebody has it's some gold digger energy in the house.
There's a new boo thing here. We hope our new boo thing coming in is not a gold digger or maybe the new boo thing that was around the last person was a gold digger. Look, happy, soulful soul. Didn't I just say, I just want to be happy. That's a superpower. Happy, soulful soul. Superpower. Happy, soulful soul. Superpower up. Now, how, how more positive can you be right there? God's work trumpets. Yes, it does. Uh, it trumpets over everything. And deepest thoughts. Somebody's in the head like, hmm. You be in them deepest thoughts, you don't even care what you look like. Like, you just be looking like you're sitting on the toilet. Let's see. We have Father, Spirit, Mother, Soul, Mama, Universe. And I love this one, and I always mess up, but let me get it right today. You cannot believe and doubt at the same time because doubt will always take over. That's the devil. And that's what this person been in too. That probably person was in too much of deep thought, and, um, and time ran out on their ass. We got a cheating spouse energy here. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. I'm not married, so that's not for me. And I don't mess with married men. No. No, not today, Satan. I just say no, no, no. Not today, Satan. I don't do things like that. I'm going to trick me up. Have me in debt, karmic debt. Look, have you in debt. The devil have you in debt. Hey, I got, I got, I got a little debt. I got a little debt. It's to say, it's just bad. It's just bad business sometimes. You know, do things. You know, you have to learn, clean that shit up. There is so much power in forgiveness. Yes, it is. Why? So that you can have peace. It's, it's, it's all about you, really. You know, God. I want you to forgive so your heart can be light. You walk around with a bitter heart. Somebody's setting their ways and they don't want to change. You gotta have to, man. You gotta have to change, man. Change with the times. And... Right now, it's the best thing is to be um, in God's good grace. God has smiled on me. He is pleased. Thank you, God. And I won't. I won't. I will spare you that song today because usually when I pull that card I sing that song but I'm not going to do it somebody says I care about you somebody cared about somebody at one point or but it said care about you as if though it's present it didn't have a D at the end because it means I cared about you at one time but it's saying I care about you look alchemist changes bad to good uh huh that's just thinking positive so that you can have po bring positive energy to you so that you can bring in, um, what is the word I'm looking for? Abundance. Pissed off. Mm. Ooh. They pissed off and they want you to open your door. Or they want you to answer the phone. Or they want you to call them. Or they want you to come back. Pissed off. You will never get this again. Ooh wee. I think I'm I think I'm in the middle of an argument with with two people right here. And um I think I'm just a messenger. This is a this is a heated argument. Somebody somebody's bamming on the door somewhere talking about let me in. And this person's on the other side talking about you'll never get this again. Somebody misses talking to their friend. This could be a friend that just wants to come back and be like, come on, man. Let, oh, let bygones be bygones. Sometimes we be like, nah, we just going to stay by and gone. Okay? Took advantage of your generosity this friend did. Or this person. And you know what, what they, they're starting to realize is that she's an empress, fool. Stop. Y'all can't fuck with her. 
She's an empress. Y'all, y'all need to stop. It's, take it. Stop. It, it, it may pertain to an emperor. You can't. It's, you're wasting your energy. She karate chopping that shit back. She's using a superpower. She's using her happy, soulful, soul superpower. And, and sending that shit right back like this. Force of God on her side. It's a waste of time. This is the truth. Messy ass person. Toxic. Stop. You, you, God sees you. Somebody has money issues. I know I my dad's right by now. Need some. Calling that in. I am a money magnet. I am a money magnet. Money comes to me. Money comes to me. We all fight demons. They attack us daily in our thoughts. Worry, confusion, anger, depression, loneliness, heart broken, sad, and mad. Envy, jealousy. <clears throat> I prophesize every good thing I am pursuing in this nation and all over the world. I will overtake and possess it in the name of Jesus. Every evil padlock that was used to shut the door of help against me, break Break it in the name of the mighty, almighty Jesus. Somebody lost out. And because of that, they're a sad sucker. Um, 7-Eleven, letting go of the past, moving forward, asking your angels for guidance. Okay. There's some easy come, easy go. Sometimes they do. It's, hey, I guess when we make it too easy for them, then they realize they don't realize the value of it, right? And then they and they come in because they never even had nothing like it. And then they come in and they think that it's just like any ordinary shit. But it be easy come, easy go. And now they're a sad sucker. This person has some family problems as well. Or this is the family situation here you need to follow your intuition listen to God someone says you're too good for me this energy that they think that you're too good for them so that's my might be the reason why they're waiting on you to call them or you to open the door and let them back in because they know they can't come they don't have they don't have the courage. They call him the telephone man. Like, hey, Mr. Telephone Man, can you tell me, is this phone number still on? Because. Riding by your house. I wonder did they move. Look, they're paranoid too. Yep, that's what I just said. Questioning. I wonder. Just paranoid. Oh, man. I guess I shouldn't have. You know, you shouldn't have. You right about that. You shouldn't have. Look, you get it from the mud. That's what these people don't understand. Like, if a person get it from the mud and they fall down and have money issues or, you know, fall short for a little while in their life, if they know how to get it from the mud, they're alchemists. They go get it from the mud again. They turn mud into money, okay? You turn mud into money. That's what spirit said. You are abundant. You get it from the earth, baby. And if you get it from the earth, you get it from God. Too sweet. Mm-hmm. That's what they used to call me. Until she got too tough and rough. But someone is too sweet. They have a sweet spirit. Or a sweet heart. Look, comforting person. A beautiful soul and spirit. That's what it's saying right here. Yeah. That's what they miss about you. That's what everybody misses about you. This person is fantasizing, sexually fantasizing about kissing you all over or being intimate with you. Spirit says stay 
low and trust because God got a plan. We, I can't wait to see this plan. It's a big one too. It's a big one, okay? Um, you're a living testimony and you will be. You will be a living testimony because what I'm saying is God got something planned for you, right? And it's going to be good. It says, Spirit stay. It says, stay low and trust because God's going to move something so big and miraculous in your life. Okay? I feel like a kid when I'm with you. Um, You acted like a kid when you were with me. Um, Ops target you, but the light protects. Ops target you, but the light, but the light protects. You are the light, shining bright light. Look, what did I say was haunting me? Was a spirit? I told you it's a haunting spirit. It's a haunting spirit that's lingering around me. I feel it. Like it's not a spirit of um, death. That's not what I'm talking about. It's a spirit of someone trying to get me to think of them trying to get me to say something trying to get me to come to them like a come to me type of thing like just constantly thinking of me making me constantly think of them Lee, get out of my head man look at this this is what I'm talking about be careful who you share your thoughts with like, this person's all up in my head. Like, they're trying to share my thoughts. They're trying to share their thoughts with me. I don't want to know what you feel like, man. Please, get, get on. Like, it's annoying. Like, I'm... Look, some people, some people come here live. You have a good time, right? And you you want more. They don't want more. You let, you, you, you respect their free will. Goodbye. But at the same time, this person, you want it, you want it, but you want it at your convenience. No, man, that's not how that works. See, now you're fucking with my free will because I don't want that. I want something solid. So you can't you can't have that from me. And this is the truth, man. That's the way it is. Got your guards up. Look, what did I say? They want you to come to them. See, you got your guards up. They want you to come to them. No, no, no. We not doing it. Look, fighting demons, real battle for a lost soul. At one point, you thought it was a mission. It was. You thought he was trying to help a person say they get their shit together. Like, what? He got a little quick to it. Guilt tripping. They want to put a guilt trip on you. Or oh, they're guilt tripping right now over the situation. They probably are. Look. Oh, they want to guilt trip you. Look, watch them. Caution. Some of them want to guilt trip you. Make you feel bad. So you come back around. That's some thoughts. Like, hey, can you? Know, come on, come on. It's like, come here. Come here. You here? I'm here. Um, Don't forget about me. Don't forget about me. You know you miss me. Um, Come. Look. Call me. Um, Just... Unblock me. No. Mm -mm. Not, not doing it. Walk by faith, not by sight. Oh, I need to get my picture so I can show you my... Oh, I'm going to make a video and show my next... The painting I've just been doing. It's beautiful. I just got all the dang gun paintings. One day, I think I'm just going to do a little... Art show outside of something. I don't know. Try to sell some of these jokers. But they all have so many. Every last one of my paintings have sentimental value to them. I don't want to give them away. I don't want to sell them. No. It's going to be hard. It's going to be like, it's so hard to say goodbye to my paintings. <sighs> okay. Thinking about... The good times we share. I really miss that. See there? I think it's time to make a new tub. A new tub of downloads. Let these be the past downloads. And let's get a future downloads. Because we tired. We tired of this. Um, Dirty hands. 
okay? And look, Echo, that's what I be talking about. <laughs> I'm not lying to you constantly in my head. Hello, don't forget about me. Um, you miss me. It's 3 o'clock. You know what that means. Um, uh, it's 7 a.m. You know where I'm at. Um, I'm on my way to work. I don't, I don't care, man. I mean, hey, why are you, we're not, we're not together no more. It's like you're still dating me in spirit. Like you will not let go of me. Let's see. Jealousy will end a connection and leave you left out. See there? You wouldn't, you tried to, this person tried to make you jealous. Look, I'm talking about my person now because it's pissing me off because I know who this energy is. Like, you're trying to make me jealous. I'm not that type of person. I wanted to be cool with you. You tried to do some little shysty stuff. Who has time for that? Life is supposed to be beautiful. If we're going to share a connection, let's, let's enjoy each other. Don't be doing no manipulation and mind tricks and shit. And um, and um, little con artist kind of uh, mo trickery moves and shit. Let that dead ass low vibration shit go, dude. It's ridiculous. Let me read this. This is the energy as well. Look at here. I got something to end this with. Because I know this is a long video. Let's do this one right here. Practice dropping the ego. Returning to wholesome, wholeness with everything and removing yourself from old patterns and ideals about oneself, pride, arrogance, selfishness, dishonor. You need to listen to your ancestors. It said your ancestors are even trying to tell you. I hear, I hear this ringing in my ear and it's telling me this is the truth. And God is very pleased because I am the messenger. We have a COVID narcissist here who craves admiration and importance and lacks empathy toward others. They want their attention on them and um, they want an emotional reaction out of you. So that's why this person played the game. Tried to make you jealous. Did all these little childish ass tactics. They didn't know you was grown. You was raised by God. You're an empress or an emperor. They didn't know because you made the door open. You opened the door to them so easily. They want you to open it back now. It echoes in your head all the time about it. They're really, really in your thoughts. You're not tripping. They're trying to guilt trip you in your thoughts. It's their dirty hands. They need to stop. They need to go and repent. And they need to kill off that damn big ass ugly ego. And this is what I'm going to leave it with as I go. Tricks is for kids. And I'm out. Peace, love, and light. Never let nobody dim your light.